Hello there explorers and welcome to a Bugman's life. It's really good to see you guys. Tonight we're going out just after sunset so that we can light up for some insects. So this is a basic light trap setup where we've got a bright light up there with a white cloth in the back. What happens are the insects are attracted to the light and I specifically use a halogen bulb and this bulb gives off UV that attracts more insects and when the insects are attracted they go sit on the white cloth once they get tired of flying around the light. Now as the insects come and sit on the cloth, I can pick the ones that I want and only catch those. So this is a very specific light trap, which makes my life easier because there's no sorting afterwards. Now while the insects collect on the cloth, I'm just gonna put on long pants and then I'll come collect them because light traps are notorious for attracting mosquitoes as well. And we all know that no one likes mosquitoes. So let's come back in a while and see what we find. As I'm approaching the light trap, I can see that there's quite a few insects that's gathered on the cloth. So let's see what we can catch. I mostly see a lot of moths and a few smaller beetles on the light trap. So let's take a closer look at these moths and exactly what I can ID. I'm not too good with moths, but I'll try my best. Okay, of these many moths, I don't manage to ID one. I should probably brush up on my moth IDing skills. So over here, there's actually a moth that I can identify. This is the Pretoria red lines moth. Over here, we've got a chrysopid, specifically a small lacewing species with its beautiful see-through wings. You should see these insects in the home quite often throughout South Africa. The ever faithful Christmas beetles from the family Melolontinae will always show up on your light trap. So I just got stung in the back by one serious wasp that was flying around the light. And as you can see, if I touch this back, there's a lot of insects that start flying around the light. And this is insects being attracted to the light. So let's go to tomorrow morning where I'll explain exactly why all these insects are attracted to the light. Why are insects attracted to light? Well, this is quite simple. Because insects that are positively phototactic uses natural light sources such as the sun and moon to navigate their way through the sky. And what they do is because the light rays from the sun and moon comes down in the exact same angle constantly, they fly keeping the same angle with the light. But once we put up a light trap or a light for the insects to catch them, what happens is as the insect flies, this angle changes. It changes from a wide open angle on this side to a closed angle on that side. And what the insect does to avoid this is it tries to keep the angle the same. And as it goes around and around the light, it goes closer and closer and eventually it's at the light. And when it gets tired, it goes sit on the light trap. And that is how our light trap works. And over here, we've got an insect that I have to catch. This is a mantispid, also known as a mantis fly. If I'm not mistaken, this is a trichoptera. Behind me, there's a heavy thunderstorm rolling in. So it's time for me to pack up the light trap and head indoors. If you haven't done so yet, hit the subscribe button and go share this video with your friends. Then remember to explore, discover, and share. And if you'd like to, go set up a light trap and explore that way. It's always interesting to see what you find. Then I will see you explorers next time.